Welcome back. We're on our last day of Rocky Mountain Race Week. The weather has been absolutely brutal. Congratulations to all the contestants who have made it back. It was a heck of a deal. We're here on the final day. We've gone through a couple rounds of our bracket racing. Now we're on to our shootout.
hit it. <laughs> it hit it in the middle. You won. I know I did. <laughs> yes, yes. Oh man. I don't even know what to say. Can we get to these awards? It's hot, man. I'm about to drive that over here. <laughs> it's hot. Oh man, this thing that thing's fast. It's fast. And it, it feels fine. It looks, it looks, I don't think it hurt anything. <laughs> It, it did hit the boost cut and I raced it before we bought it. So it hit it. All what right, do you think, man? Down. Yes. Yes. Very happy. First first big win. Yeah. What's that mean after driving all them miles? I don't even know. <laughs> I'm just happy, man. <laughs> I, I mean, I, I thought he had me, but whew, I don't even know what to say, man. This is, this is my first first time ever winning anything, you know? So I'm feeling good. How many, how many race works have you done? Uh, race weeks since 2020 all of them yeah yeah i never missed one first big win man. first big win yeah uh, well i won uh true street 90 yeah. in 21 but this is the first like big big win you know what i'm saying so yeah real happy so happy <laughs> perfect way to end the week love it dude and i couldn't have done it without that man right there <laughs> that's it if, if it was for him not as, I'll be on them back to New York already. I'm telling you. So yeah, that's it. And winner at Unlimited with a 683 with a stranglehold on Rocky Mountain Race Week 2024 with the javelin, Brian Coldstone. Also, we're gonna go ahead and do overall because again. Stranglehold on this thing. Brian Goldstone, your overall winner and the winner of 7,500 extra dollars. <laughs> and your winner. How much, dude, money, how much money did this dude get? Oh, yeah, this guy got $7,500. Steering wheel anymore because you push it through the steering wheel. This dude's got the biggest smile in the whole place right here. A little bigger because he's 7,500 bucks this time. Man, give it up for him, man. He's going back to New York State with that Grand National. We'll see him back. Beating up on all y'all in Limited Street in the future. That's right, in September. <laughs> in September, that boy is gonna be back in September. That's what I'm talking about. The uh, Juggernaut Welding guys built both of these flags. One is the National Anthem. The other is a Second Amendment flag. We forgot raffle tickets. <laughs> so, so instead of raffling them, <laughs> minor, it's a minor thing. It's, it's, minor. it's a, yeah. When you do a raffle, you need to have tickets. <laughs> it's the it's the first word in raffle ticket. <laughs> but it's semantics. It's all good. Um, tell us what we're gonna do with those and where the money's going. I'm gonna take them home with me. Um, and we'll put it online so everybody, not only here, but everybody across the Race Week family can uh, get in on that. And uh, yeah, obviously we had some issues this week. We had a couple guys get in an accident. We had a couple cars get stolen. So we can try to raise as much money as we can off of those and split that up for them see if we can help them out. So dig deep when that stuff comes out because it's going right back in the Rocky Mountain Race Week family because that's what Rocky Mountain Race Week does. Hey Adam, we got a special something for you. We had to get you. That's been in the planning all week, and we've screwed it up the rest of the time. You look good in the wet t-shirt, right? Can we give it up one more time? Okay, give it up for the number of times that Matt has to shake.
shake his head either at me or at Adam this week. Right there. <laughs> There's plenty. Yeah, there are plenty. I, I don't. We're, is there anything else we have to do? I, I, we interrupted, but we had to. I, I have to tell you. Um, I, I want to give a big personal thanks to to Matt and June. Um, I know we you know, seriously. morning he knows I'm awake he calls me at 6 30 in the morning we bend each other's ear and gripe about things and plan stuff and I, I just want you guys to understand that it's a year away but the amount of planning that him and June and me and Adam and everybody else are putting into 2025 I really hope you grasp how amazing this event is going to be so we really want your support we really appreciate you guys and I have to say you know you guys are all my family I love you I know Adam tells you all week because he's on the mic um, I'm looking forward to 2025 I'm gonna announce half the event Adam's gonna announce the other half we're gonna have two live streaming crews it's gonna be epic so uh, well, it's get either ready. gonna be epic or it's gonna be a total shit show. One of the two. Well, so, either, way, either way, it's gonna be or something both. to talk about. It might be an epic shit show. It might be an epic shit show, but that's okay. It's gonna be a good time. It is gonna be a good time. So everybody, be safe going home. <laughs> Adam's gonna dry off. He looks refreshed. <laughs> uh, we really do appreciate you guys. Please be safe uh, and have a good time. Uh, I'm wet and he's hugging me. <laughs> You're welcome and I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright everybody, you don't have to go home and can't stay here. Give it up We're all out.